Hi, Dr. Larry here. I hope you're doing well today. So um, right away this morning, I woke up and Archangel Michael was kind of like beating down my door <laughs> and saying, you need to tell people this message. So um, I've already tuned in and I'm just going to like go right into it. <sighs> what, what he wants you to know is yes, there is a lot of stuff going on in the world today that is atrocious, that is horrible, that is unbelievable. And also maybe in your own lives, maybe there's some stuff that's going on that's coming to light. You're feeling emotions that you haven't felt um, ever, uh, that you're finding out things, things are shifting in your life that you don't understand. And what he wants you to know is that it's going to be okay, first of all, but to do your best to detach from the situation. Do your best to detach from what is happening outside on the planet right now. Um, it doesn't mean sticking your head in the sand. It just means that you don't need to get wrapped up in all of the chaos and the turmoil of what's happening around the world. He understands that you have a big heart and that you love humanity, but the best thing you can do for humanity is to detach and not bring your energy into that chaos. Because when you go into that chaos, all it does is it festers in that chaos and it keeps it going. But if you can detach from the situation Deal with your own emotions, deal with what's going on with your own life and heal that part of yourself, then that in turn is going to help heal the planet, okay? Oftentimes we put our focus and attention on things outside of us because we don't want to look at what's going on in here. And that is a really big message right now is look at what's going on in here, okay? And, and also, you may be coming up on, if it's not happened already, but you will, <laughs> come up in a time in your life where you're not going to agree with somebody. And someone's going to think that you're crazy for having the ideas and perspectives that you do. Probably people that are very close to you, that you find that you don't understand them or they don't understand you. You might feel like you're a scapegoat or um, you're the black sheep, like nobody gets you. And please trust yourself. If you are thinking differently than you have in the past, that is your awakening process. That is seeing life in a different perspective. And even though it feels foreign to you and people may say that you're crazy thinking this, trust what you're getting. Strengthen your intuition and trust what you're getting because this is what we're learning how to do. We're breaking out of the old way of thinking and we're bringing in new beliefs, new pers perspectives. Actually, they're not new. They're just, they're very, very old. They've just been covered up by other things. Okay, so trust yourself mostly. Mostly trust yourself. And there's a favorable outcome. Okay, it might not be in your time frame or my time frame, but there is a favorable outcome. All of this is happening for reason. Everything needs to be seen to come up. All of the stuff that you we're seeing today has been going on for a very, very long time. It's just, we're seeing it now. The truth is coming out and this is waking people up to what is really happening on the planet. It doesn't mean that things are getting worse. They were always that way, okay? They were always that way. We're just seeing it now. So by seeing it, and healing our own traumas, we are actually transforming the planet because when we step into our light, when we shine our light, when we heal the lower density emotions and traumas that are in our body, we start to shine more. And when our energy shines more, it shines on other people and it gives them permission to shine as well. So your healing benefits you, but it also benefits the people close to you and people that you don't even know. 
So I know it's not like the woohoo message, but it is, um, it's very needed because it is really intense and he just wants to let you know that you are loved, you guys are rocking it, those are my words, and that everything is going to be okay. There is going to be a favorable outcome. So do your best, you are doing your best, and thank you. Thank you for being here on the planet right now. It's not easy. So I hope that helps. I hope you have a beautiful day.